Hey there, Foragers. It's Rachel here. And today we're going to look at how to properly write a thank you note. So you want to start with a very standard thank you note. Um, they don't have to be anything special. This is just a random one that I had sitting in my thank you note stockpile. Um, yes, I do stockpile thank you notes because I think that it's very important to send handwritten thank you notes to people. Um, whether you are sending a thank you note for, say, someone that is that has taken the time to give you an interview, whether you are a scholarship recipient, whether you have gone and visited a college and someone spent the day to personally take you around, or whether you have received a present or money, something along those lines. If you have just sold something at the 4-H auction, a livestock animal, um, it is great to send a handwritten thank you note. Um, sometimes emails just don't do it justice and it looks nice to actually send something that's handwritten. So today I actually need to send my great uncle a thank you note for some money that he sent me. So I'm gonna open this up and I'm going to start by saying, Dear Uncle Terry, so make sure that you catch the person's name that you have been working with, um, especially if it's been an interview or something of that matter. Then what you wanna make sure to do is you want to make sure that you put in there what you were thanking them for, not just thanks for the gift or thank you for the interview or just thanks for being there. Try and make it as specific as possible. That really means that you took it, took it to heart what they did for you. And the biggest thing would be to make sure that you tell them how much you appreciate their generosity. As you can see here, I've written, Dear Uncle Terry, thank you so much for the money you sent me. I really appreciate how generous your gift was and it will help me build my savings account. Love, Rachel. Now, if you're going to be sending this to a colleague or to someone that has just done an interview, you would obviously want to sign it best regards or sincerely. Um, then you're going to want to put it in the envelope. And then you're going to want to address it. Um, and of course, you're going to want to put a return address here, their address here, and a stamp there. Now, if you were sending this to a business or you were sending it to um, a college or something of that matter, you're going to want to put the address that you find where it needs to be sent. And you're going to want to put something along the lines of attention and then that person's name. So make sure that you get your thank you notes out there. Um, and I will say that uh, there is a, a large um, portion of a generation left that really does love um, handwritten thank you notes. I love getting handwritten thank you notes and I'm not part of that generation. So make sure that you get that out there and um, really show how much you appreciate um, what people do for you. All right, have a wonderful day. Bye.